Hey guys, welcome back to another video. As you might have noticed, a lot of skate parks are closing now, which means that which means that anybody that wants to skate has to go out street skating. And for those of you that haven't street skated before, it might seem scary and you might be confused and you might not know where to go or what to do since skate obstacles in the street usually aren't that obvious. Which is why it's so important for us skaters to try and be more creative with where we're going and try to think of things that we can skate. It is spring right now, which means that it's coming into rainy season in Hong Kong. There has been uh, spurts of rain going around. So I'm gonna head over to um, the famous underbridge spot that I've been to a lot of times, but it's usually just one big ledge and nothing else. I wanna go over there and try to think of some creative ways that we can skate the spot and hopefully give you guys some ideas as to what you can do while we're in this crisis. So let's go there right now. All right, we've made it, technically. It's over on that side, um, but I realized that I forgot to fill up my water bottle, so I'm over here to get a drink and we'll be right on over there. I might come back over here because there's a two stair over there, which is where I did my first two stair, so I hit that again. There's also this three stair over here, although the run up is very short. We'll see, let's get a drink first. I don't have my octopus with me right now, so we'll try to figure out a solution for a hydration later on. Let's go over to the spot now. We are here. Seems like a lot of skaters thought the same thing coming here. So I may move in a minute, but I might skate here just for a teeny bit, then go to a different area under this bridge because uh, the floor is still pretty wet outside. So let's see what we can do. Try to keep my distance. next to these trees. Kind of like a slabby ledge, but it's really rough. So when it waxed up real good, we could try to do some tricks on it. Let's hope this works. I finished waxing up the ledge, um, but I just wanted to point something out before we went into that. This is a good example of trying to use your creativity. Some kids pulled over a table over there so that they can word slide that, do some tricks on that. So that was really cool. But yeah, I'm gonna practice some no slides over here. Let's go. Right now I'm just trying to do some practice with the no slide because I don't always have my nose fully on it. Uh, which would be better for higher ledges. I always have it like this. So I'm trying to really stick it on there, you know? I'm trying to practice that. See how well I can do. I would say that counted. So, good job to me. show you in a future video. There's quite a lot of people here but I also really want to skate these makeshift obstacles right here so my plan is try to land at least one trick on them and then we're getting out of here. Let's hope that I can land something.
those board slides counted because I kind of want to move on to a different trick. I might go back to it in a little bit. So, yeah. The security just took away everything. He's over there. He put it behind uh, those doors over there. So there's no more board slide. Yeah, let's go find something else. There is this little trinket over here. I'm gonna see if I can try to uh, front nose it somehow. Try not to get my board wet over there. But yeah, should be pretty wax already. Let's get it. obstacles that you can make something out of you can do tricks down it tricks off it tricks into it so yeah always stuff like this there's a million options but I want to try front nose since I don't usually practice that trick a lot sometimes you can just practice over a line and there can be endless possibilities you can pretend it's a manual pad or you can just practice height timing etc so yeah let's go Let's go. Not gonna lie. It is pretty wet. There's some stuff over Yay. there, I think, so I'm gonna check that out. If not, there's a three star over here, which is not wet. A little bit tricky up the runway though. Try to figure something out, and if we can land it, I guess we're lucky. about this is that they closed all the water fountains so I'm incredibly thirsty right now I borrowed somebody's octopus to get a drink before but I finished that and I drank the rest of my water so what the hell are we gonna do now not completely sure what to do can I get a cup of water Yeah. Good thing there are some restaurants around. Okay guys, I'm sorry I couldn't get a lot in. It's just me practicing some tricks and giving you some ideas on how you can be creative while street skating during this crisis. My battery is about to die.